Welcome to a special series on health, a look at healing from within with Dr. John Duong. Dr. Duong, welcome. Good to have you on the program. Thank you. Let's start first as sort of the groundwork for our conversation today and this series uh, to better allow listeners to get to know you and most importantly, your philosophy when it comes to health care. Uh, yes. My philosophy is that, like, just imagine if you have a full cup of water how can you get more water through this cup without spilling? So I understand this philosophy when I was in, in my 20s. It's all about love. It's all about sharing. So what I do is that when my cup is full, what do I do? I share with other people. I empty my cup so my constant flow of water will go through my cups. That's how I gain knowledge is by sharing my knowledge to other people so I would make other people better with me so I just love that philosophy and I keep practicing that once I learned it and for me I learned about health I see how powerful the healing from within is so I would like to share this information to share, share this knowledge that I gain to the audience that I will be contact with one of my goals for this year is to go around churches and sharing how does the body heal from within? So one of the church that I went uh, last month, which is October, is Wells Community Church. And I, I did have a great time sharing with the information there. And I want to continue to share this to the world now. Healing from within. Where is the sources of healing? Is the creator. God's give us the permission to heal. The healing is inside us. We have to permit the body to heal from within. That, of course, leads us to today's topic, and that is the issue of chronic pain. And there are millions of Americans, yes. as you know, who suffer with chronic neck pain, chronic lower back pain. And I think a lot of people, particularly by the time they reach their mid-50s and 60s, sort of shrug it off. They accept it as a natural part of growing older. They accept prescription drugs in order to anesthetize or numb the pain, never thinking that there would ever be a possibility to be free from the pain in a natural approach. Talk to us about how is that whole idea of accepting pain is just a part of growing older wrong? That is not right because pain, we can fix it. I learned this from Old Nightingales. He said 95% of people will fail and only 5% succeed. What's the difference? Why is that numbers? He said that because people simply don't think and they do not have a plan. They don't have a goal. So what do we have to do? For me, I'm just talking by myself. The first thing I pray is the wisdom. I need to pray for wisdom so I can determine what is right. So by asking questions. So if you have pain, in particular in the neck pain or back pain, the first question is that why do I have neck pain in that area? So for my patient, the first question I ask is that if you were to have a neck injury or back injury and you take an MRI or an X-ray, why is most of the injury? So that's why we think now. We have to think. We have to process. Why is the most injury is the C4, C5, which C stands for cervical. In the C4, C5, and C6, it has the most degenerative, most arthritis, most herniated disc at that level on the neck. How about if we in the process of thinking on the L lumbar as the most injury is the L4, L5. L5, S1 has the most degenerative press on the nerve so it, go, it travel down to the leg, a sciatic nerve. So why are those the most common area? So we need to ask questions and then how can we fix it and how can we prevent this from further damaging it? How can we prevent it from co even coming back after we fix it? Now, the predominant approach by traditional medicine, of course, has been to provide drugs that numb the pain, but never really address that underlying question as to what is causing this degenerative case in those areas yes. that you mentioned specifically in the neck and lower back, and most importantly, to use the body's natural ability to heal from within to begin addressing that. So instead of relying on outside painkillers, we're instead harnessing the power of the body to heal from within. How do we go about doing that? The first thing is that we need to know why is that the most degenerative on, on that area, that like C4, C5, C5, C6, L4, L5, L5, S1, is because us, like for example, when we sit, what do we do? We slouch. When we slouch, what does it do? It compresses the disc more. It put more pressure. As a result, the disc will degenerate faster. 
there's the arthritis is building up. So the loading would be there. The hernia disc would press on the nerve. So what do we have to do is that we have to solve that problem by sitting it up correctly. So my mother said, sit up straight in your chair. That was actually good advice. That, definitely. But when we have the problem, like some people are experiencing like excruciating pain, that like if they have a neck problem going down their arms, or if it's back pain going down their leg, excruciating pain, what do we have to do? We have to solve the problem. There's uh, multiple causes for one discomfort, one pain that you have. So we have to solve, usually is the disc. We have to fix the disc. And there's technologies that's available, the latest technology to help the body to fix the disc. So at the end of the day then, a lot of these causes, as you're suggesting with chronic neck and back pain, come from bad habits. Bad habits um, is accumulations. A lot of it is accumulation. We bend incorrectly, sitting in it correctly, or we have a trauma that we never take care of it. Oh, when you are young, you're invincible, right? So it just build up. And then also there's like, or it can be a trauma. So the high school football injury 30 years ago now suddenly comes back to, uh, to haunt you. Exactly. So at the end of the day then, teaching people how to use the power of information to correct behaviors, harness some of the technology, and ultimately ab allow the body to do what it does best, and that is to regenerate itself. We know that our cells are changing over thousands of times every second and regenerating, exactly. but oftentimes we don't really know how to properly put that power to our good use. God had a bigger plan, and unfortunately, yes. oftentimes, we ignore that plan, don't we? Yes, so we need to go back to natural. First, if you do have an issue, is that why does it cause and change the bad habits? And if it were pressing on the nerve, you have a herniated disc or stenosis that's causing it, we have technologies to fix the problem. Let me mention for listeners, if you'd like to get more information, there's going to be an ongoing series available at Dr. Duong's YouTube channel. That's simply Dr. Duong Live on YouTube, Dr. Duong Live at YouTube, also at his Facebook page. And over the coming months, you'll be able to continue to watch this series. Allow your knowledge to grow, as Dr. Duong suggests, as he is pouring out his cup of knowledge and providing that information to us. He, in turn, will gain more information and pass that additional knowledge on to you. If you'd like to get more information, let me encourage you also to go to Dr. Duong's website. That's drduonglive.com, drduonglive.com. As we say, you can also follow him at YouTube and on Facebook. And also for listeners, there is, for a limited time, a special offer where you can receive a free in-office consultation Good through December the 20th, but you need to act now by calling toll-free 800-470-0828. That's 800-470-0828. And Dr. Long, tell us a bit about what happens in that consultation. Consultation, the first thing is that if you do have uh, pain, if you do have chronic pain, we want to find out where the cause of the problem. And can we use the four-point therapy that we have to help the body to fix itself, fixing the body from within so we do have technology to fix it for you. If you're sick and tired of being sick and tired or maybe concerned that you've been taking all of these medications to kill the pain because, I don't know, you've got an aspirin deficiency, well, we know that isn't the case. We know that where the deficiency is is the lack of knowledge and understanding to both the underlying cause of the symptoms and then most importantly, a lack of knowledge when it comes to harnessing the body's own natural ability to heal itself from within. Want to learn more? Again, that special offer of an in-office consultation, absolutely free. This offer is only good until the 20th of December when you call toll-free 800-470-0828. That's 800-470-0828. 470-0828, and as always, more information available too on the web at drduonglive.com. That's drduonglive.com. Doctor, thanks so much for the time today, and we look forward to the next installment in this series. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for the audience. And again, more details on the web, drduonglive.com.